Attention pre-PA students and PA students. I am excited to announce that Get That C University will be launching this coming Sunday, October 11th. Get That C University is the coolest place to help you get into PA school and through PA school. So go right now to getthatcuniversity.com and sign up so you can be the first to know when the site launches. And in celebration of the launch of Get That C University, I will be coming out with a brand new video every day this week answering all of your questions. So leave a comment in the comment section below and tune in to see if your comment is one of those that I answer. Go on over to Get That C University right now and sign up so we can help you get that C. What's up you guys, it's Adana and welcome back to my channel. I know, I know some of you are excited or you're, you're surprised to see me today um, and that's because you haven't seen my video from yesterday. So if you haven't seen my video, um, in that video I stated that I will be going live every day this week or putting out a video I should say every day this week um, in celebration of my new platform Get That to University. So if you haven't heard about it, go on over to Get That cuniversity.com right now and sign up so you can be the first to know when my platform launches because it will be launching this upcoming Sunday, October 11th. But I said that I was going to be answering all of you guys' questions and so I have had some questions that have been posted to me. So I'll be addressing some of those throughout this week. But one such question is from YB. So I'll have that question up on the screen somewhere for you guys to see it as well. Um, if you have a question that you want answered, go ahead and leave that in the comment section below right now as well. And subscribe so that you can know when my new videos come out. Um, but it says, Dear Adana, please give the advice about shadowing. I, so I'm gonna, it says, I'm done with all prereqs except this nobody wants to take me for shadowing now so sad and yes yb it is so sad that there aren't really anyone doing shadowing right now and that's mainly because of covid um so it's been a little bit more difficult getting people in um, because you want to minimize the the amount of exposure that individuals are getting especially students right and so honestly at my hospital we only just started letting um med students and pa students back into like their rotations. So that has actually been something that we've really not had for the past six months that I've been there. But in the this last month of September, they've been having it. Um, and so when it comes to shadowing, it's a lot difficult now because hey, people aren't allowing you in. And I get that. I get that that um, that ploy, that plight that you have. But I have a solution, um, and it is virtual shadowing, which I will be offering on my new platform, Get That C University. So with the virtual shadowing, what I've decided to do is have various different PAs and um, you know, in the future, we're gonna have other professionals as well um, in the healthcare field give, kind of take you through their day. They're gonna walk you through their day as a, you know, neuro PA or myself as a trauma PA or as a general surgery PA or as a pediatric PA, whatever it is, you're going to be able to choose from several different um, physician assistants or doctors or whatever it may be, nurse practitioners. And they're going to be able to walk you through their day. Um, you're going to virtually see like a patient with them and you're going to be able to ask them questions once all of this is done um, in the form. So you can also look and see, like I honestly just kind of reach out there, look on Instagram and, and see if there's anyone that is actually offering in-person shadowing experiences. Although I think that that is like something of the past now. So PA schools are gonna kinda of have to get on board because you're not gonna be able to get shadowing hours like you used to before because hey, we're not allowing people in like the the hospital and just the medical settings like we used to. They're either gonna decrease the amount of shadowing experiences that they're requiring for you or they are going to um, just allow virtual shadowing to be the thing of the future. Uh, you know, we are in a world where we're, we communicate via Zoom and StreamYard and YouTube and Instagram and all things virtual. And so it is 
something of the past in patient like in person stuff so um i'm really excited about this virtual shadowing that i'm doing i'm that i'm going to be offering i'm really excited for you guys to see it i think you guys will gain a lot of information from it at least like how to interact with patients and some of the tests that we may order um and then kind of some of the symptoms of various different uh disease processes so that you're going to be just that like one step ahead of you know your colleague that may not have had uh, that experience. So hopefully this helps and this answers your question. Please tune in tomorrow when I answer another question. I may be answering more than one question depending on how short or long that answer will be. Um, but leave your questions in the comment section below because I am reading them and I am going through them and I am picking questions to answer. So leave that in the comment section below. Go ahead and like this video. Sign up at Get That to University university.com subscribe i'm telling you guys to do a lot follow me on instagram you know the drill you guys thank you guys so much for watching i appreciate each and every one of you you guys have been amazing subscribers so i love you guys i will talk to you guys next time bye